Here is the projection, the new projection now. In the first video, the projection was 375,000 or less would be the goal to have owed on the first position HELOC by the end of December 2024. The new projection is anywhere around 389,000. So we're about $14,000 short. Again, that was unexpected, you know, tax. I, I knew I had tax, but the number was a little bit higher than I thought. And the unexpected expense copy. So that about, you know, does it right there. So we know where that shortage is coming. We can clearly see that. What I did here, super conservative, I think I think I'll end up doing better. All I did was reduce anywhere from like 13 to 10,000. And I really just did 10,000 all these months. The first month I reduced it by like 13,000. So really the cash flow per month will be about anywhere from as low as 10 to as high as 13,000 in net cash flow. But again, as I'm doing velocity banking, what's actually happening is there's about 20,000 or more that's actually sitting in the first lien HELOC. Expenses are coming out slowly, so the interest cost is what's gonna make the, the difference, right? So I'm, I'm assuming already kind of calculating interest in here and then just reducing the net number by principal net number going down by time. So by April, that should be around 431 because we borrowed the out, we took out of the HELOC to pay taxes and pay the policy. So it drove the number up and then income went in, cash flow uh, expenses came out cash flow stayed net number should be around 431 may 421 then june jumps up goes up because why well we're paying policy the 84k once that happens that 84 goes into my policy then i'm going to borrow $46,200 out you'll hear me say that in the first video $46,000 uh, loan policy loan comes out brings the balance back down then another net 10k new cash flow for the month of june so the balance would be anywhere around 459 to 449 because in June is also the estimated tax payment. So it might net around here or somewhere around here. We'll see. My goal is to create a video each and every month, typically around the end of the month, to show the result of the previous month. So in April, I'm gonna show March's actual number. In May, I'm gonna show April. So that's how we're gonna do it. July should be around 439, August 429, September, October. September will be another tax payment. So that'll come out over November, boom. We should be around 389, right, or less by December. Of Here's my mindset as I process it.